Central World. Central World. Mm. Sunday Nyanga was about 34 years when he participated in his first general election back in 1980. It was all different back then when the biometric voter registration system that dominates electoral process today not in the picture. Now, 68 years, Nehemia Nyanga came here at Tororo District Electoral Commission to pick his voter location slip. He will need the slip to elect presidential and parliamentary candidates of his choice. As a senior citizen, Nehemia is struggling to keep up with the technology that comes with the biometric voter registration system. We have heard they have brought to you what we shall put our finger on any. We are here computerizing the system. Nehemia wants the candidate he votes into power to address particular issues. He, knew, he knows what the majority do because the when I went to school, they told me it is the backbone of the, of the country, agriculture. And he has explained, tried to explain. I followed him thoroughly. If, I think if I am to vote, I will vote that better one. While Nehemia is big on modernization and commercialization of agriculture, Youth here in Tororo who are voting for their first time want problems in the education system addressed. I want to change, for example, like in schools, learning facilities, I want some change because there are so many schools that you find that uh, there are no learning facilities. That's why you see that most, especially science subjects, they are failed because people lack apparatus, what. So we need at least uh, some improvement. Like in the village, oh in our country. Also at least you have to get somebody whom you think it can cater or he can cater or care for your people. Electoral Commission officials in Toro said they have everything in place apart from the ballot papers. The biometric voter registration system has come in for some slack but Frederick Mwaya, the district returning officer, has thrown his weight behind it. We have had uh, two um two Saturdays on which we have demonstrated the use of the biometric voter verification kits to the public and it has performed perfectly well. The battery has performed um, beyond expectation. Security in Tororo is also on alert to ensure that there is peace and order during and after elections. Toro District, which has 233,437 registered voters, has five direct constituencies and a woman parliamentary seat. This are Toro Municipality, Toro County North, Toro South, West Vudama North, and West Vudama South. The race to represent Toro Municipality in Parliament has attracted nine contestants. It is, however, expected be a two-horse race between the incumbent Sanjay Tana and former legislator Apollo Fono. We have a lot of projects that are on, uh, on the way, like for example uh, uh, the road networks, improving road networks, the bridges that we are constructing, improving access to health care, improved education services within the municipality, improved access to clean water, uh, power to peri-urban areas that I have been able to take using my own funding. I really want to, to begin where I stopped in 2006. I, we had schools, we had health centers, two primary schools, so we shall start from there. According to the information that we have got, a number of people in Toronto here have already picked their voter location slips and the town is very busy with a number of rallies as people take this last minute advantage to listen to what their candidates are promising. Agnes Nandishu, MTV, Toronto District.